Dr. Bennett, are these students going to have to make up a week of school at the end of the year? What's, what's, what's the evolving policy of uh, our DOE? The diapers get away. <laughs> Mike, we, first thing I'd like to start with is we, the guidance we received from the CDC has been pretty clear, and that's the dismissal of students should be strongly considered uh, when a confirmed or a suspected case that is epidemiologically linked to a confirmed case. So as a result of that, um, we've been in the, the county health department, the county health officer issued an order to close the two elementary schools. Um, we have agreed and we agree that in this situation, those schools, and I want to be very specific, those schools will not be required to make up those days. Under the, the, the Indiana law, there is a provision under extraordinary circumstances the decision can be made to waive the financial penalty for not meeting the 180-day threshold. Therefore, in this situation, those schools will not be required to make up those days. Okay, I'm sorry, Ian. I'm going to have to call into the news conference, but you can individually contact the superintendents of the individual schools or Marion County if you do have any additional questions. 